This is Dave Palumbo with RxMuscle.com. I'm here at the 2011 LA Fit Expo. I am here with a legend in bodybuilding and wrestling circles, Rick Drayson, the man also who does Rick's Corner on the RX Muscle website. Nice to finally meet you in person. About time, don't you think? Yeah, yeah. Uh, 3,000 miles away, are we? That's right. Well, I told you I was coming out here. I'm glad you were able to make it. I always keep my word, Dave. Always keep my word. Now, you're the first guy I looked up to. Are you really? Yeah. I feel very honored, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. Even before I ate, and I'm hungry. Uh, Rick, your, your little video blogs you're doing on our site are very popular. A lot of people like them because you, you find all the old timers, yep. you find the new timers, yep. and, and you give all your old wisdom from back in the old Venice Gold days. Um, what, what was the impetus to start doing this? Well, the thing is, is that i got to use my wisdom now because next year I might get Alzheimer's. That'll be the end of it. Ah. You know, you never know when you might forget what happened. Yes, I, yeah, I forgot what happened this morning. Um, I started doing this because I was teaching wrestling, as you know, and I had the kids doing... Uh, like promos with the mic. Right. So I took them into my my garage and I put a banner up and I said, let's try it there. Then I built a green screen and someone said, why don't you do Rick's Corner and do the Legends of Bodybuilding? I said, good idea. So I started digging out my archives, thinking what I knew and I wrote articles and I just started to go with it and started asking people to do. Sure, sure. And it just seemed to take its own course and, and uh, I went on to see that I have two million viewers now on YouTube. What did you think about the Jack Elaine's passing just recently? Well, he lived a long life. You know, I mean, 96 is a long life. Did you know him personally? I met him on three occasions. Very nice man. And know you can stay in shape and you can do everything you can to stay healthy and live. But when a disease gets you, like pneumonia or something like that, and you're that old, boom, you go. I mean, he lived a great life, though. Well, he lived a great life. What was the best interview you'd say you ever did? What was your mo the, the, the most, the one that you're most proud of? God, I've had so many. I think the one with Joe Weider I really, really liked. That was great that you got Joe, that. Joe meant a lot to me. And he was just a wonderful man, and he was very, very gracious. He gave me a lot of time. His assistant said, you know, he gets tired and he has to rest, but Joe said, no, let's just keep going. Now, how did you get Joe to go along with this interview? Because he doesn't do interviews with anyone. I called him. Really? And he, he said, good? Said, fine. That's phenomenal. Well, that easy. And I actually called Jack LaLanne's uh, manager, and she said, I'd like to get you in to see him, but he's not doing well. This was in June. Call back in August. He's not feeling like call back. She says, he's really not feeling too well, but I'll let you know. And so I missed out on that one. Gotcha. What about Arnold? Will you ever get the Arnold interview? I'll get Arnold. I'll get him by the throat. <laughs> I'll get him by the neck. Well, I hear Arnold now is going to be training back at Gold's Gym Venice. I've heard the same thing. And and all i got to do, what would really be funny, I was telling my son, he said, wouldn't it be funny if you guys trained again and did a workout, you know, like 30 years later, and get it documented on film? Here we did then, and we'll do it now, two old guys trying to lift the weight. Oh, if you could get that, that's a gold mine, Rick. That would be, that'd be awesome, you know. The joints are gone, the elbows, the shoulders, I, I don't know if he could. Who do you think's better? Who do you think's stronger right now? I am. You think you'd outdo Arnold? Absolutely. He, he says he's making a comeback, though, in the uh, movies. He might be training hard. He's going to have to train awful hard to catch up with me. The one and only Rick Drayson of Rick's Corner. If you want to catch all his words of wisdom, his tips of the week, and a lot of his uh, interviews with the old-timers uh, and legends of our sport, check out rxmuscle.com in the video section. Rick's Corner. Rick, great seeing you. Thank man. you, Dave. Really, really a pleasure. All right. Dave Palumbo, rxmuscle.com.